Hello to everyone. So we are back and I'm going to try to make this version of the pink drink that I saw Patrick make. We have the Welch's white grape juice. We're going to use a quarter cup of that. We have the organic coconut unsweetened. They didn't have the regular because he said that regular could be used. So I bought this one. This is the exact coconut milk that he used. We're going to use one cup of that. We're going to use freeze dried freeze dried strawberries and we're going to use one packet of this crystal light wild strawberry does that say with caffeine i won't be sleeping tonight but we're going to try that i'm going to put some ice in my little thing right here and this is the attachment to my ninja blender but we don't have to turn it on and then i'll be right back now his name is patrick meyer and he does a lot of diy starbucks drinks and there are people that do this with some kind of a starbucks refresher drink the acai strawberry i can't find that some people use um different teas and things so i'm gonna try what he did we're gonna put these back in the fridge and we're gonna go from there but before we do i'm gonna go ahead in my ice here he said about a cup i did about this much ice when I did it before he said the grape juice for the little zing in the tang then he said the water and then this crystal light packet so we got that in there and he started off with three-fourths cup of coconut milk and then he added a whole cup so we'll see how this goes I think with the coconut milk, you can do it to your own liking, as little or as much as you like. So I'm going to put these up. We're going to come back. We're going to put the lid on that and shake it up. I forgot to add some of these freeze-dried strawberries. We'll do that now. I don't exactly know how many I need, so I'll just put that many in there. These are kind of funny to eat. We're going to put the lid on here, and we're going to shake this up. That's definitely a snack I won't be eating out of the pack. I got my little Starbucks cup here. And we're going to put this in here and we're going to shake this up. And pause for a minute and make sure I got a good seal on here. So doing this one handed, but I do want to share and I hope you can see this does have the texture I was looking for. Because guys, when I didn't know to add water and I did just a little bit of coconut milk, I thought it was like maybe a quarter of coconut milk to maybe like a cup or a cup and a quarter of juice and it curdled. So, oops, sorry about that. My daughter will murder me if I break her spray. But yeah, so this is definitely the texture that I want. And when I did it yesterday, I poured out some and then I put the rest in the fridge and drunk it later. So we're gonna see how this one tastes. I like the one that I did with that juice. And then I thought about using that juice instead of this juice. But the question is, this packet went into this mix. I did ask him if he ever sees my message. If I wanted to substitute in that white crayon strawberry juice, how much would I use? Because as you know, this mix went into all of this. I like the way that looks. So we're going to pour some into a glass and see. And I'm going to try to... Since I don't know how to do links, there's a section under the video description for an at. I'm going to at his channel. He does some pretty good do-it-yourself videos for drinks. Um, and he shows a great video for this iced coffee maker and a vanilla bean frappuccino. And he's got a fun personality. So here we go with the taste test. I'm very excited. Now, I do not have the kind of ice that Starbucks has, but that ice at my job would be perfect for this. So, guys, what do you think? Besides my um, freeze-dried strawberries being bigger <laughs> than Starbucks, I think it really does look authentic. So, let's see. This tastes a little bit more strawberry to me than the actual strawberry drink that I had, but I do like it. And it's something quick if you want to do it yourself. I would probably add a tad more bit of ice water in here is what I do. Or I would let it sit into the ice a little bit longer. But it has the texture. 
and these little strawberries do they um turn into the same texture of the strawberries that are in the drink plus i think i don't really like sugar-free stuff and i know that crystal light is sugar-free now i will try this again with my little sugar syrup when i get some but it's not a hated drink i'm just going to add more ice water or let this sit in the ice a little bit longer so give this a try if this is something you want to do and especially if you love sugar-free drinks and you don't get the starbucks drinks because of that so until the next time everyone have a great night